just got back from Trader Joe's. I wanted to get some of the seasonal items that they had because we don't have a Trader Joe's really near us. It is about 45 minutes away from us. And even if we go where it's located, there's a Whole Foods also. And between the two stores, we always prefer to just go to Whole Foods. And there's never any time just to go to Trader Joe's and hang out. So I wanted to show you what I picked up. It's always so fun just kind of like browsing, looking around and seeing what they have. So let me show you. So we are at the coast right now and I needed to pick up stuff for breakfast, but I also wanted to get a few seasonal things. So I have my seasonal things over here, breakfast items over here. I think I'll just start with the seasonal items. I picked up these corn chips. They don't taste like anything. They're just really cute. I mean, they taste like something. They taste like tortilla chips, but they don't taste like, you know, like the pumpkin or anything, but I just thought they were cute and festive. And with that, I picked up this fall harvest salsa. It includes pumpkin, apples, and butternut squash. So it'll be interesting to see how this taste I hope it's a little bit spicy I'm assuming it is because there's a little jalapeno on there I also picked up this non-dairy oat maple creamer type thing for my husband's coffee he has ulcerative colitis so he, he tries not to have a lot of dairy but he wanted something flavored so I thought this would be good in his coffee in the mornings I picked this up for breakfast how can you say no to this this looks amazing so I figured I'll make these for breakfast one of these mornings along with our eggs and bacon. I also picked up these petite pumpkin spice cookies. I thought they would be fun for the kids lunches or even you know just for us to have here just a snack on or just to take them back home. They are shortbread cookies with pumpkin spice and yogurt coating. Yummy. I also got this. I'm probably going to end up just taking this home but it is pumpkin pecan oatmeal. And this looks so good. I could probably just make this on my own at home, but I wanted to give it a try for those mornings that are crazy busy or even for the kids. They like oatmeal. I'm sure they'll love it. And if you saw my last video, my last Starbucks treats video, I ran out of pumpkin pie spice. So I picked some up. I actually wanted to read what they have, what is included in here. So in Trader Joe's pumpkin spice blend, they have cinnamon, ginger, lemon peel, nutmeg, cloves, and cardamom. Cardamom was something I was probably missing in all of the other treats I was making. So it'll be really cool to see if there's a, a difference at all in the flavor and the smell. So moving on over to just regular items. So some are breakfast, some are kind of snacky. Um, let's just start over here. I have cream cheese for our bagels in the morning. I picked up, I'm assuming these are kind of similar to like animal circus cookies. They're also similar to those petite spice cookies, but my husband doesn't like pumpkin, but he loves animal crackers or circus animal. What are they called? Those frosted things, you know what I mean. So I picked these up, I'm, I'm sure he'll love them. This is something I want the kids to try. No, frankly, I want to try it too. These look delicious. They are little crispy peanut butter filled wafer sticks with raspberry fruit dip. Oh my goodness, I think we're gonna do like a little taste test trying those because I'm kind of hungry. I picked up some milk for the kids. I got some coffee and I had them grind it for a French press because that was what is included here at the Airbnb. I picked up some crackers to go with my cheeses that I got. I got two dozen eggs. Like I said earlier, I think we're able to get some fresh eggs, but I wanted to pick these up just in case. I like heavy whipping cream in my coffee right now for whatever reason. It is just so good and it doesn't take much and so it's a little tiny thing. The French Brie, this is on their Fearless Flyer and it looks so good. I'm a huge soft cheese fan, any cheese, what am I saying? Even the stinkiest of cheeses, I love all cheese. So I got this and then my husband likes more of a hard cheese. So I got this. I'm not sure how you pronounce this. Comte? I have no idea. Please don't make fun of me. I don't know. I got some breakfast sausage. I was trying to find the like regular pork sausage. So I'm not going to tell them what is in it. I'm just going to make it. Of course, everything but the bagel blend is a necessity. Here are those avocados that he left out for us. And he said we could take them home too if they're not. Oh, this one's ripe. So if they're not ripe, we can take them home. So that's awesome. I did pick up some apples for me. Strawberries, they lo my boys love strawberries. I'm surprised they didn't actually open this right now and just start tearing into it. I also got some avocado tzatziki zip. I never say this right. Tzatziki? Yes, let's just call it that. 
I got that to go with our tortilla chips back there. Some carrots to dip in that as well. And some bacon. So not a huge haul, but just something to kind of tide us over for the next three days. I'm sure there will just be a couple of like the pantry items that will come home with us. But I'm sure the majority of this food will all be gone. Hey, you guys want to try these? Because I want to try them. I'm hungry. Here is what they look like. I'm going to give them a try real quick. Here we go. Let's see. Ooh. Mmm. I thought it was gonna be like super like hard. It's really soft actually. Oh, that's good. I don't even think I'm gonna share this with, with them. <laughs> I think I'm just gonna eat it. Mmm. Those are good. With a glass of milk. Oh my gosh, that would be so good. I am gonna have to share this with them because I kind of want to hoard the other packs. So let me just share this open one with them. They're called PB and J sticks. So you pick up a peanut butter stick and you dip it in the jelly. Let me see. What do you think? Really good? Peanut butter in there. You like it? What do you think, Quinn? PB and J S. What does that mean? PB and J S. Peanut butter and jelly sticks. Oh, okay. PB and J S. Okay. Quinton, did you try the jelly? You like it? Mm. And I'm not sharing the rest of them. Mm. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Um, Should have bought two. Dang, guys. Take it easy. Okay, let me have one more, please. Okay, you guys have to split that one. Brav, let me have some. Give me this, some jelly. Look at this. Oh my goodness, don't make a mess, though. Watch, okay. let me, watch me eat it. As you can see, that was devoured in seconds. By me also, so <laughs> I can't just place the blame on them. Calvin, do you want to open up that tortilla chip, please? That was so good, the pb &J. It was good, huh? Can you open up those chips for me, please? Okay, I'll open them. Mm. They're pumpkin spice cookies. I guess we can have, let you guys have one of those, too. Why not? We're on vacation. You can spoil your dinner. Let me see. These are oh, leaves. Oh, look at the little leaves. Those are cute. Other kinds of leaves too. Okay, well let's try. And all um, harvest salsa. Yeah, let's try it with us. Okay, guys, give the salsa a try. Okay. Let me see what you think. <laughs> it's hot. <laughs> okay. You like it? So you like it? You don't like it, or do you like it? You don't like it? No. Oh, is it too spicy? No. It's spicy. Oh, okay. Calvin, but you like it? Mm -hmm. Okay, I need to try it too. Pretty good? I am gonna try it. I'm going to try this myself with this cute little leaf here. So here we go. Look. I mean, they taste very good. They're definitely not as spicy as this kid's making it. It's a little bit of heat. Nothing that... <laughs> He's saying now it's good, of course, but it really isn't hot. Anybody can really handle this. But I like the sweet aspect of it. There is like a hint of sweetness to it. It's it's so good. It. I don't like it. See the little leaf? Mama, I like hot spicy. Oh, oh now you like hot spicy? Okay, now you like it? See, it's not spicy, little weirdo. Just because I said salsa. Thumbs up now? Okay. <laughs> All of us thumbs up for salsa family. I'm not sure if my husband will like this. Maybe I should ask him if he wants to try it. He was willing to take a bite for me. And he's holding the baby, so let me get him one real quick. So, Dad, this is a fall harvest of salsa. Quinton and the boys are eating it up. Here we go. Look, I mean... You don't like it? That's good. You like it? It's like a little bit of heat, right? A little but bit, like, it's pumpkin. like yeah, it's like sweet though. It's good. Mm -hmm. Kids are loving it. I'm loving it. But look what I got you. Mm -hmm. What do those remind you of? Animal circus. That's why I got them for you cuz I was thinking because of you. I mean, that's, your, that's your dad's favorite. My, um, my dad dad's likes it and his dad before him. Cookie. And his dad before him. 
<laughs> now I hand it down to you. But first, you have to eat it, right? Power. No, you marry me. <laughs> <laughs> I left. And a little one over there is still eating the salsa. Like I said, it's not that spicy. Let's give these a try. I already opened them. Okay, guys, these are little pumpkin. Oh, they're cute. Here you go. Okay, what do you guys think? Give them a taste. More pumpkin power is good. Thumbs up. This little white one's cute. All right, I'm gonna give it a try. Exactly like animal, those animal circus. What in the Mama, world are they called? Are they Mommy, called the animal circus? I like how spicy too. Or the animal cracker? I'm thinking, you know, there's like the, the frosted ones and then there's those ones that aren't frosted where they used to have like the bars behind them like they were in a cage and then people thought about the cage. I don't know. I don't know the difference. There's one oh, frosted, no. one's not. These taste exactly like them, but there is definitely that pumpkin spice in it and I'm all about that pumpkin spice. It tastes really good. I'm over here real quick and see if the, the sun is setting. Yesterday there was sun and that is it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you liked it, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing. There will be a lot of fun videos coming up, especially with Christmas just around the corner. So we will see you in the next video. Bye guys. Something in the air And a sparkly shimmer